Well, hello. Hi. Hello. <laughs> good, good. Good afternoon. Yes, good afternoon. So, how are you today? I am good, ma'am. What about you? Yes, I'm. I'm also doing great. Uh, first of all, my name is Abigail. I'm from Shillong, Meghalaya, and okay. I'm a I'm a trainer here at uh, Ace Fluency. So, this is the first time we're meeting. So, it's a pleasure to meet you, Shweta. Can you tell me more about yourself as well? Before starting this video. I would like to inform you that if you want to improve your spoken English skills, then you must download an amazing app, Ace Fluency. I will provide the link of the app in my description box. Although this app provides 30 minutes free talk time, but if you want to use this app more and more and want to use more features available in this app, then you need to take subscription. In this time, you can use my promo code SHWETA10 to get 10% extra discount. So don't forget to use my promo code SHWETA10 to get 10% extra discount. So go and download this amazing app Ace Fluency and enjoy your English speaking journey with Ace Fluency. I'm Shweta. I'm from West Bengal. I'm a homemaker and oh, nice. I'm in the journey. Yeah, hmm. I'm in the journey of learning English um, and apart from it, I have been working as a Hindi translator. So oh. I need to translate English documents into Hindi. Hindi. So Hindi okay. is my mother tongue. Uh, I know very well, but when it comes to English, I need to improve myself. That's why I have joined S Fluency and I'm working on my English. Oh, all right. I, I believe you're progressing well because there's a lot of clarity in your voice in your speech. Thank you, ma'am. Yes. <laughs> How, how's your preparation going? How's your uh, study going? How's everything going for you? You said you're, you're working on translations and all of that, right? Yes. And uh, you're also trying to improve in English. So what are you doing right now to improve? What are the things that you're working on? Yes, English is all about practice. The more we do Definitely. practice, the more uh, we will um, be confident, we will be um, uh, expressive and our um, level will be increased. So mm -hmm. it's all about practice. I, although I do practice, but I am not satisfied with the effort. <laughs> I want to put Don't more and that. more <laughs> First of all, uh, be confident in yourself and always celebrate your success. And it, it, when it comes to anything, uh, be happy with how far you've reached, but always work hard, uh, work more. That's always there, but always celebrate your successes. Even if it's a small thing that you can accomplish uh, when it comes to English learning as well, always celebrate your success, always be positive. All right. Thank you, ma'am. Yes. <laughs> really, it's true. Uh, we should uh -huh. celebrate our success. But, yes. uh, but uh, human natures are... Uh, yes. Uh, <laughs> we are not automatically... Definitely. Become negative. <laughs> Definitely. We are always negative. I think... Uh, Personally, I am also very pessimist, pessimistic, sorry, when it comes to anything, I tend to say, oh, I cannot do this, I cannot do that. But recently, I've been uh, watching a lot of videos and reading a lot on motivation and all of that. So that comes time and time again, always celebrate little things, always celebrate your success, always be positive. Because once you, if you're positive, it builds your confidence and your motivation also. Mm. So yeah, that really helps. Yes. But when it comes to English, ma'am, what happens? Uh, we generally compare ourselves with others. Yes. And when, yes, when yes. I saw the person who is doing better than us, then we mm -hmm. started feeling uh, inferiority complex and negativity. Oh my God! Uh, <laughs> I never be able to speak like uh, this or that. So uh, that <laughs> that is there. <laughs> but then. When it comes to English also, don't compare yourself. I know it's difficult to say this, but the, the only person you should be comparing yourself with is yourself. So think about what your level was last week or yesterday. Compare yourself in that way. Don't compare with other people. 
okay because other people have maybe they've gone through a different journey when it comes to english learning so it's not the same we don't go through the same thing right so yes so it's it's no point comparing yourself with others okay so compare yourself with yourself <laughs> yes. how you are today with how you were yesterday all right yes. what have you learned how far have you accomplished right i think yes. uh, when it comes to language learning a lot of things you have to keep in mind you have to first of all understand the reason why do you need to learn english i think for you it's because of translation because you need to do a lot of translation work from hindi to english so that should be a clear objective for you that's the if you remember the reason why you're learning english why you're studying english it'll help you set goals also yes right? ma'am correct yes. Yes. For translation, I need to correct my written form, and in written mm -hmm. uh, for written English, there are lots of tools um, already yes. available. On yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Translate or uh, Grammarly. Grammarly. There are lots of tools available uh, where you can correct your written English. Written But English. But when it comes to speaking, uh, it's uh, difficult uh, to express yourself in a right way. So, <laughs> and uh, speaking English boosts your confidence. And yes. I want, uh, so that that's also a reason I want to. Um, and many places I face difficulty where I mm -hmm. feel that I need to express myself in English. So mm -hmm. that's the also reason uh, why, uh, that I want to improve. <laughs> yes, yes. Think whenever you're speaking, think of a normal and a natural conversation that you're having. Okay. Don't try be too. Don't be so strict on yourself. Like. be too afraid to make mistakes or anything like that just speak normally how you would with another person like for example what we're doing right now just speak naturally speak normally okay and when it comes to speaking what else are you doing to improve on your speaking skills sometimes i record myself uh, uh, to care where i am making mistakes uh, while speaking i uh -huh. come to know that okay shweta this time uh, this sentence formation is not correct this sentence uh, should be like this so uh -huh. in this way i record myself i speak in front of camera um, but uh -huh. i got satisfied with my efforts what <laughs> <laughs> uh, i no 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 i i think you're doing a great job i i think you you're, you're you're improving right i know i'm still meeting you for the first time but yes like i said earlier also there's a lot of clarity in your speech as well when you are uh, recording are you also comparing whatever you've recorded to a native speaker's audio anything like that or is it just you recording uh, i would suggest do one thing listen okay. to a short audio clip it can be for just let's say one minute a very short audio clip of a, a native english speaker try to imitate that imitate the native english speaker record yourself okay, okay. so record yourself imitating the the native speaker and then mm -hmm. once you're done recording that way you'll know okay play the recording and at the same uh, at the same time or after you you play the recording you play the native speaker's audio that way you'll know or oh, this is where i made a mistake this is where the pronunciation was wrong something like that okay because you 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 need you need to be able to compare okay yes, yes. because if you just play a recording of yourself you yourself may not know this is this wrong is this right but if you play and compare with a native speaker's uh, audio that way you'll understand where you're making the mistake even the intonation am i speaking like the like the native speaker the way he's speaking am i doing the same thing uh when he ask a question am i raising my voice am i raising my voice right the tone of my voice so all of these things you'll be able to compare and then after comparison correct so you can do this with a number of audio Okay, so wow. listen to so nice yes. after, after recording of this video, I will limit you, ma'am. Oh, go ahead, go ahead. No problem. So, uh, you have a YouTube channel also? Is that yes, yes, ma'am. Oh, okay. When did you start the channel? It's been almost one year. Oh, nice, nice. How's it going? Many? Uh, do you have many subscribers? Many followers? Uh, till now it's near about 1k subscribers um, oh that's a lot and, uh -huh. 
when i started uh, i just put my voice over uh, content not uh, face oh, uh, not, not uh, your uh, face ha ha but <laughs> after uh, posting uh, too many videos i got confidence the and confidence. now I'm facing <laughs> camera and talking with you ma'am <laughs> oh that's great that's great so what what do you what is your content all about what do you what kind of content do you post in your uh, youtube Basically, channel um, i i have a lot of vocabulary collection means word me oh, word, word which have same same spelling but have different meaning like handle mm-hmm. how to handle the situation cup of ah. the handle is broken yes there was some network issue yes yes just continue what were you saying uh, something related to a particular word maybe you were talking about handy handle the handle the cup yeah all that yeah yeah so yes. same word uh, same spelling but have different meaning so i have collected oh. many words and uh, created video on that topic but now okay. uh, because uh, i am comfortable uh, to face camera so i want to post conversational videos uh, so okay, that i great. can improve my <laughs> confidence i can improve my english <laughs> speaking english <laughs> definitely that that will really boost your confidence uh, i will tell you one thing i am also not very confident when it comes to this speaking in public i was not very confident when it comes to this speaking in front of people speaking in front uh, front of you know uh, the audience and anything like that even in front of the camera i was always very <laughs> I'm, i'm camera shy <laughs> but uh, gradually i think with a lot of have taking a lot of sessions meeting new people this has i've i've come out of my comfort zone because of that so i think that has really Great. helped so with practice yes yes so i think uh, for you also it was the same thing we have to come out of our shell <laughs> just be comfort- comfortable with this so um I was about to ask you something. Uh, so how do you prepare for content and do you get a lot of time to work on this? Not that much because I am a housewife so first half I have to spend on my household work but um whatever the time I uh, my heart is uh, creating <laughs> content <laughs> I stay with creating content and the content we have, uh, which I watch and feel that it touches my heart I thought that I must create a video on this topic so uh-huh. that people can uh, also um, connect with that topic uh, yes, some yes. motivational videos uh, I have uploaded short motivate motivational videos videos how to deal with the situation how to be positive so these type of things uh, i have posted uh, <laughs> oh that's 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 great i believe you have a lot of experience then because one year creating content for youtube and all of this you must be quite good i guess when it comes to this <laughs> because <laughs> youtubers there are a number of youtubers who are quite creative Uh, when it comes to the content so i really appreciate that because uh, i myself i don't think i have that <laughs> i'm not very creative when it comes to content and all of this but it's good to see that you know others are actually doing this and uh, i i really applaud the number of people and youtubers i think i've seen a number of them who are posting publishing these kinds of content uh, english speaking conversation uh, sessions as well because you really are motivating and helping other learners there's so many i think many of your viewers also they when they look at you they they feel confident because maybe they themselves feel okay i am too scared too shy to speak but oh there's someone who's like me and who's trying her best so it's it's mm-hmm. motivating mm-hmm. <laughs> it's motivating mm-hmm. for everyone <laughs> everything right. happened with me and i started and one more thing uh, youtube gives uh, freedom of time whenever mm. you want to work uh, you can uh, you can talk according to your timing so it's a great thing <laughs> which internet is a blessing for this era it definitely you <laughs> definitely you can just sit and work from home you're earning uh, money as well you're earning your your get you're getting to pay your bills and all of that just by doing something that you like to do right and creating content and all of this is something that you love doing so i'm just glad that you're able to do that <laughs> so uh, I, i would like to know about your mother tongue ma'am what is it my i i i speak khasi i'm from shillong khasi uh, let me type it it's khasi 
Khasi. Okay. Uh, it's uh, this is the name of my tribe as well. I I come I come from Shillong. In Shillong, we have three tribes. We have Khasi, Jantia, and Garo. So I'm a Khasi. I speak Khasi. And oh. uh, yes. <laughs> have you been to Hindi? No, I can understand a few things. Uh, actually, right now I have my friends teaching me Hindi as well. So. Hopefully, I'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> but you are speaking good English, ma'am. I can oh, understand you. very well, and I'm feeling good <laughs> talking with you. Mm, great talking to you as well, Shweta. Right. See, look at ma'am. You don't know Hindi, and I uh, don't know Kasi. But still, because still we're coming, we are we're able, able to. <laughs> <laughs> definitely, I think it's it's a wonderful, definitely wonderful language because it unites people. See, all yeah. over the world, you have so many languages that people speak. But still, we can communicate. We can express ourselves. We can understand each other because of English. <laughs> so we really have to be, you know, we're quite grateful that I know the language so that I can, you know, talk to and understand other people. <laughs> yes. Anyway, uh, is it fifteen minutes already? I think it's. time but uh, is there anything else you'd like to add before we wind up uh, shweta uh, tell me what difficulties you have faced in your journey as you uh, told me that you are shy you are uh, not so confident so what bring uh, brings you a uh, level that you are now working with sqnc and talking with me so uh, I, what you have done ha ha uh, actually when it comes to speaking in uh, in front of people in this way i think it all started during the pandemic i uh, got a job working as a trainer and taking these training sessions these online sessions and then suddenly i had to conduct meetings something i had never done before so i was pushed into that i was motivated into doing that so that's how i started conducting meetings and then taking uh sessions for a large a, a, a big group of people right and just doing it again and again and again somehow that really helped when it comes to <laughs> me speaking in front of people although i am see online fine the the confidence it it, it builds gradually but uh, speaking in front of people uh, via online mode it's nothing compared to speaking in front of people you know uh, face to face with them <laughs> that would that is another thing that i would definitely love to overcome because i still have stage fright when it comes to speaking uh in front of a large crowd or in front of a large audience physically <laughs> because <laughs> online i'm comfortable now when it comes to online meetings online group sessions uh anything anything like this online it's fine for me it's i'm i'm getting comfortable with this <laughs> but physically i still need to work on that so let's see <laughs> i wish one day i will saw you to uh, speaking in you'll front of me. crowd uh-huh. <laughs> yes i i hope i hope you'll see me do that confidently <laughs> yes uh, anyway So it was uh, really nice talking to you Shweta it's a pleasure meeting you I hope to see you again in another session as well so that we'll get okay. to talk and we'll get to converse more and I'll get to know more about you also <laughs> <laughs> Okay okay ma'am really um, nice yes so take take care then Shweta you have a great day ahead a great uh, evening mm-hmm. ahead Okay same for you ma'am mm-hmm. okay. bye 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 <laughs>